everybody. <clears throat> he needs some milk. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, welcome back to another video. So I just want to say this is my fourth video that I've recorded today. So if I'm a little bit slow on the get-go, that is why I've worked hard. Well done, me. I saw this picture years ago on Tumblr, and I mean literally years ago. Some last liked a dress. A grandma looked at the dress and went, oh, I can make that. So she sent her a picture of it. She made the dress. And then someone said, ah, you basically illegally downloaded a dress. That's been ticking in my mind, not lying, for about eight years. I've kept that bit in my head, and I've never known why. And then I saw Cactus's video. Have you seen that episode of SpongeBob? Terrifying. <laughs> Ooh. Where she makes custom content in The Sims, and I thought, that? That's why I've held on to that, so I can do this video. What I want to do is kind of illegally download clothes for my Sims. So going on actual websites like Urban Outfitters and looking at styles that I like and trying to recreate that in the Sims. So that's what we're going to be doing. I'm picking Urban Outfitters as well because we don't have one of them in my town. I'm going to, I say it all the time, but live vicariously through my Sims and let them enjoy it. I'm going to look at tops first of all. And I just want to say I can't really make meshes. Oh, all oh, right, it's back. Oh, eh, 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 oh, oh. I am going to try and learn how to actually make a mesh, but I can't as of yet. I'm going to have to use tops that already exist, but I do like this diamond butterfly top. I don't like the fact it's diamonded. Sorry about that whole poison thing there. I don't like the fact that it's diamonded. Oh, do I? I don't know, but I'm going to add this to my bag. Unlucky for you, Urban Outfitters, because I'm not actually going to buy it. I'm just keeping it all in my bag so I know what I'm working with. Also, going to stay away from out like this because I don't like English tech. In The Sims, I only like it to be Simlish. Although, maybe something like this would be cool. I could have Simlish font here, and then on the back, and this could be a picture of a flower in game or something. Mm -mm -mm. Adding that to my basket. Oh my God. There's also a summer sale. Oh, 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 I like that. Oh, I like that. Oh my good god. Mm -hmm. I need to stay on track. I kind of like this sunflower cami. We might be able to make this. I am such a sucker for stripes. So I'm going to have to include a striped top as well. I like this. Not enough to not scroll past it though. So maybe not. Right, like I like this one. And I'm pretty sure we have a topping game that I could recreate this kind of thing with. And adding it to basket. I want a couple of dresses. I'm going to be so bad at this. Like I'm proper out of my comfort. Not even out of my comfort zone. I'm just out my depth. I really like this style. I don't think I'm going to necessarily 100% illegally download this one. But I really like this odd polka dot style. So I think I'm going to recreate that somehow. I'm just going to move myself over here so you can see we have this polka dot kind of dotted style one this stripey one a sunflower one this cool looking one and this diamond air one so i'm only going to keep it at five because i don't want this video to be like seven hours long we'll start off with the butterfly one and the striped one because i can see them being the same mesh that we use and we'll see what we can use to recreate this look Make them away downtown gender female age adult part type top content custom this riley blouse could work well because it's the perfect type of boxy at the front and we could even make it a little bit more snazzy by having it like this at the back let's do that butterfly and striped this is what it looks like the edges are a little bit uh what's that word called scallop that's the one yeah the edges are a little bit scalloped but that is completely fine but the front of it looks pretty similar to the vibe that we're going to try and go for with this let me grab these ones out we've got the lilac and the diamond here i'm going to start with the diamond here one first export this butterfly fly away that's not that okay this is actually going to be quite hard the further in that you zoom the more messed up it gets why did i choose to do this like honestly why did i choose to do this what i might do is try and get this like that because it might be easier to work with if i just kind of distort it a little bit oh i've deleted it. no i didn't mean to do that no get back being very 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 careful because this necklace is heart of the outfit mm, don't want that the butterfly is kind of there. I need to grab all of this. Bippity, boppity, boom, boom. Oh, maybe I should zoom in actually before I do this so I can actually see what I'm doing. That would be wise, wouldn't it? Whoa! <laughs> Find a colour similar to it. That one could work. Oh my God, why is this went so well? Like straight away, I am a little bit suspicious. I'm not gonna lie. Just gonna extend it out a little bit. Did I just ruin it? Perhaps. Oh, it's all right. It's fine, right? Butterfly fly away. Let's import this in. See how we've done. That's not too bad. It's not. Just the entire thing will move there. Yeah, that works a lot better. That's not looking too bad. 
no. <laughs> to be honest, actually, I have to go back to the thing. The actual thing looks a lot more um, just better. Maybe if I bring it up a little bit. That's looking a little bit better. It's not looking very high quality at all. I will say that one. But for what we're working with, like we are working in The Sims. So, I mean, that's kind of good. Right, now on to the striped one. Let me just copy. Ah, no, I've opened up Adobe Premiere. I didn't want to do that. Oh my God, no, please, because it takes so long. <laughs> it was nice knowing you all. That was a bit dramatic, actually, for how quickly that's just ended, but get rid of the rest of this last because I don't need air. I'm not going to do the exact same thing and put this over the top. I'm just going to take the colours and make my own stripe. So the background one is like that colour. There we go. Perfect. We have a white stripe. which actually isn't looking very white at all. There we go. Still looking a bit blue though, isn't it? Maybe like there. Then an orange one. We can do this, lads. Great. I can already see this working. This could be my full-time career. Have I done that right? Oh, I'm stressed already. You know what, right? It's fine because I can just use this as the middle stripes. And then we need this dark blue one. Decided to speed it up because, you know, once you've seen one stripe, you've seen it all. So I decided to speed it up. Enjoy. Right, I can... Oh, no, what's happened? Now I can just duplicate them. Look, that's not too bad. Right, she can go now. Bye. This can now go over there. I am shocked, but also proud of my little self. Right, now the challenging bit is actually gonna come now when I need to try and make this not just look like I've overlaid a pattern off a shirt. See what I mean? <laughs> like, I need this to actually look okay. The multiply kind of looks all right, but it's a bit too... Well, it's not like 100% there, unless I've just done that. No, no. That kind of works. It looks a bit too light. Oh, no, it doesn't. No. Okay, maybe if I just turn the level... No. What I might do is just get a rubber or maybe a burn tool. I don't know. Let me see how this looks. This one I thought would be the easiest, but it's honestly not. I mean, it looks okay. I might just honestly just spruce things up with this one and kind of use my own initiative and just like delete this bit. So all of the tops kind of white is in the bow area. I hope I've got the right things. I think I have. And then also maybe, I don't know. Cause I'm thinking making this bit white and then all like this back bit white as well. That might work better for me personally. Or it might work better just to hide my bad skills. That's also a very strong possibility. Just don't get how people do this. Like, how do people know what to do? There, yeah, I think that looks a bit better. Yes, 100%. That looks so much better. Butterfly ones. <laughs> On, upon further consideration, the butterfly one, not great. But I love the back of this one. And I can't even take credit for that because I didn't make the back at all. But the back is absolutely beautiful. Got two done. That's been fast. We'll do the sunflower print ruched cami right okay okie dokie dokie let me just save this package has been saved thanking you so now i need a cami top i'm sure i've got them i'm not sure if they'll be ruched this is ruched oh this frilly top that's also a contender or maybe this because it's not as low cut but it can work this is what we're working with that's what we've got to achieve. Get this one up in Photoshop. Wow, it's actually very easy. Works well for me. And then what we need is the sunflowers. So I can either go on Google, see if we can find us. I don't think I'm gonna. I mean, that's, but that's like nicking someone else's work. Right now, we're gonna have to load up the game. We're going in guys, we're going in. Everybody get ready, get your troops. We are going in a battle. By battle, I mean the Sims 4 loading screens. It's a tough time. This is my little photo shoot. You, you two need to get out, right? Cause I'm not here to make friends. I'm literally here to illegally download clothes get out get out just because she's pregnant she thinks she can take liberties how much of it is actually in the image though right so we do need some of the green stuff too that's fine because we've got it there perfect let's leave these don't need these anymore i'm gonna have to load the game up to get the flower for the other top i so um, i hate myself let's get this sunflower in it's gonna be really low quality why does it do that like i feel like it's on my end but is it and let's just completely steal our outfit i also want to move these up a little bit actually i could just kind of get away with just the one leaf because i think that's all she has on hers oh great wonderful wunderbar and then I just need to copy and paste about 50 of these. Plot them all about. But hey, this is not going so bad, you know. You've got a big storm coming. You turn, you turn, you turn, you turn. I just sound like I'm a sat nav. <laughs> I'll meet you back once everybody's turned. 
turned, get turned. I think that's good, I can get rid of her now. And then everything on here, I need to duplicate and put over here. This is the most long-winded thing. Let me just select the inverse of this, get rid of all these extra ones. Darken it or something, oh no. Lighten, maybe. I like that one, color dodge. Does that look like it? Yeah. Oh my God, yeah, that actually looks, that looks all right. Well, if I do say so myself, let me chickity check it out. Yes, I'm proud of myself. Next one, I'm moving through this quite fast. Like I've only been recording for 40 minutes. I thought this would be at least a two hour job. Touch wood, touch wood, touch wood, touch wood. Cause this could all go downhill for me. Yeah. I'm gonna do this iris long sleeve skate shirt. <laughs> No, I'm not. I'm not. I've decided against it because the text is so small, specifically on the back, that there's no way that I can do this without the text getting morphed or whatever you call it. That's the word, distorted. So I'm going to skip this one and we're just going to go on straight onto the Jocelyn dotted print puff sleeve dress. Why Jocelyn? Why is Jocelyn so special? Why is it not Jessie? I need to find a dress that looks like that. Don't think I've got one. This one might work. It's not necessarily the same type, but it's got the puffiness of the sleeves, so we could just use that on there. And I think personally for me i am most likely to use this dress on my sims so i'm gonna do this to help me out as well we have a color that's kind of similar that's plain this one i could probably morph can you select like multiple oh my god i did not know you could do that oh hey well that's good is the last one here we go i need to copy and paste our color don't i so i actually i know what we're working with here i don't know whether to just go for hue that worked pretty well that's like pretty much the exact colour. I might even just make sure that I'm getting it 100% right because we haven't got the dress 100% right. So I'm going to try and get the colour 100% right. So yeah, about there. Eee, well, that is fan dabby dozy. Right, I basically found this dotted print online. So I think I'm just going to use this. I hope it's seamless. It better be seamless. It kind of is. It kind of is. It's working. Going rather well. What's gonna go wrong? Because some of it is. Some of it always does. I mean, obviously, it's not an exact copy of the dress. These dots are a lot thicker. Actually, what I could do, right, to make these dots thicker is do an outer glow of just black and make the size like a one. That makes them a lot thicker. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep, yeah, that's like, that's much more similar to the actual dress. Shocked and surprised, honestly. I'm going to save all of these packages, load up the game, and I'm going to see how well we've actually done if we have. Kind of nervous to actually try this out, but let's try it. The biggest task is going to be actually finding it. This is going to be really hard. Better not be that one. I will fume. Here it is. Here's the butterfly top. Like I said, it kind of, I don't know why it is. It must be me because other tops, for example, like this one, uh, the kind of are, but like not as badly as that one. Do you know what I mean? So I don't know why that gets like that. And then the striped one is actually really, really nice. I like it. I do. It looks a bit like a hospital gown because of the colours and like this thing at the back. But I really like it. We also done a sunflower top. Where for art though? I have a feeling it's this one, you know, because I, I literally cannot find it anywhere. Right, let me look for the dress. And then after the dress, I'm going to exit the game and go looking for the top because this is an absolute disaster. I like it. To be honest, I'm 100% I'm a fan of that. Yes, I like it. Right. Now, there's the dress. Let me just exit the game and see if I can find this goddamn flower top somewhere in my mods folder. Okay, so this is definitely the sunflower top. Now, I'm going to say it's not because my creation was bad. It's because I don't have the mesh installed for this top, which is really rather sad because I was actually most looking forward to the sunflower top. I'm sad for that massive failure, but this is the end of this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. This has took me in like quite a while, so I just hope you just enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you haven't already. We're getting really close to 100,000 now. At the time of recording, I think I've got like 93,998. So please subscribe because I'm getting so excited for 100,000 and I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys. Bye.